Hey Avakin fam, Flying Hedgehog here again, and today we're exploring the Avakin Party Hub's Lucid Odyssey Event 2024. A prompt indicates it's a party for Dio's team Dark from this year's Valentine's Day event. In the center, a beautifully crafted fiery photoshoot area beckons, likely orchestrated by the creator to encourage capturing and sharing images on social media. At the opposite end, an interactive archery setup awaits, offering the chance to vanquish pesky cupids, as directed by prompts from the creator. Rather than pursuing Aphrodite's henchmen, let's delve deeper into exploring the location. Upstairs, you'll discover a finely furnished dancing floor, embraced by the excitement of fireworks and interactive laser guns. To the right, you'll encounter the inviting whirlpool of the apartment, creating the perfect ambiance for relaxation and socializing with friends and family. In the left wing, the creator has installed two interactive fire rings, enhancing the fiery atmosphere of the location and inviting guests to engage with the elemental energy of the space. And here lies the extent of what you can explore in this space. The remaining delights await as you dance the night away on the vibrant dance floor and revel in the comfort of the exquisitely crafted apartment. While we commend the effort with a 5-star rating, it's important to address the downside. The developers' reliance on community efforts to create social spots and events, rather than taking initiative themselves. In conclusion, while the Avakin Party Hub's Lucid Odyssey event 2024 offers an array of activities for participants, it also sheds light on a concerning trend. It serves as yet another instance where developers rely heavily on the community to design event locations instead of innovating themselves. This practice, particularly evident in the ongoing Valentine's Day event, feels lazy and lacks the captivating allure that comes from professionally crafted environments and unique events. It's disheartening to see the developers outsourcing their responsibilities to the community, resulting in events that feel more like a collection of user-generated content rather than curated experiences. This reliance on user input may ultimately dilute the magic of Avakin gatherings, leaving participants yearning for more authentic and engaging experiences crafted by the developers themselves. As we come to the end, we want to express our heartfelt gratitude for your viewership and support. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up as your feedback means a lot to us and helps us improve our content. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and enable notifications for future updates. With that, we conclude today's video. This is Flying Hedgehog, signing off and wishing you an amazing time at the party. Until next time, fly high and stay awesome. See you in Avakin Life.